will notify you this once presentation you begin your I am going to describe you how we can form delta neutral strategy and also I will demonstrate starting. All how we can form an option strategy which can give you consistent return in all kind of market. So for forming the delta neutral strategy either you can keep delta as zero, delta as negative or positive. Delta net delta positive strategy is recommended in a rising market with low volatility condition. Whenever the volatility is less than 20% in any instrument we used to say it is low volatile. Net delta negative strategy is being recommended in a high volatile market in the falling price trend and net delta zero strategy is being recommended whenever you are going to or aiming to gain from the time value decay and the trend is range bound. Range bound in the sense the price will neither move above a particular resistance level or nor it will fall below a particular support level for a period of at least three days. So that is known as your range bound market. And whenever you are forming a net positive negative delta strategy, keep the net delta around 3% 3, 3 level so that minimum 3% level and maximum 10% level it is, it is recommended for forming the delta neutral strategy. So what is the meaning of the delta? If the nifty goes off by 1% and say if 7700 call option is having a delta of 0.5, this says for each 1% change in the nifty will bring 5% change in the option time value component or 5% change in the option premium. So this is what the meaning of the delta and delta neutral can be formed with the anticipation of a positive market, negative market or a range bound market. So I will show you certain trades here. So I will show you certain trades here but I have initiated in this month of the July. If you are a member of our Google group you must have got this particular strategy. So here in the strategy is being recommended on 26th June. It has following components like 7700 call option 5 lots I have recommended to buy at 90 and simultaneously to sell one lot of future at 7550. It was having a net delta of 1.17 and the consolidation band at that particular time was 7618 and 7518 and we have expected if the upside is giving us a breakout above 7700, our profitability will be around 11,000 at 7740 and projected loss will be 5000 at 7409 level. And net delta I have kept it as 1.17 which is almost 11.7%. So I have recommended you minimum 3 and maximum 10 you can keep it. So it is slightly above that because of one lot if we reduce that it is coming below 10 so I thought that instead of that if we can increase one lot it can enhance its performance. So this trade I have initiated personally so here here is my trade details 26th June 26th June 2014 so this is around 11.35 this trade is being initiated 7700 call along with the along with the future sold and same trade is being closed on 3rd July 3rd July 2014 so at 7773 and 187 level and roughly it has given you given us 11,000 rupees profit so so 7740 level we have expected we have just got the profit at 7773 level so this is what this is what this this is how the delta neutral strategy works 
and how to how to make this delta neutral strategy if i can just show you in in our option strategy software then it will be more clear so here i am going to form a delta neutral strategy for august i have load, loaded the data today 31st july i am recording this event and 31st july so this is the data of uh, nifty i am loading here so this is for august series i am going to form the delta neutral strategy and delta neutral strategy has lot of uh, benefits once this data is got loaded i'll go for the grig scanner wherein i need the delta of all the options so here is my call option call option now the volatility of the nifty is around 9% 9% from the past 10 days data it is a low volatile condition and the trend is obviously in the upside direction and nearest strike is 7800 it is focusing 7800 is currently at 86 rupees around 315 time and its delta is 0.54 so i am just going to take this information and form a similar kind of strategy suppose if i am selling the nifty future of august at 7750 one lot and simultaneously if i am going to buy the call option of 7800 and that two five lots so i got 0.54 as a delta and i am going to hold it for five days and i'll just calculate it this says that this particular strategy at 7700 level will give me 1700 losses and it can give me 5000 profit if it comes to 7793 or 7800 level so each level if I can just compare my so upon crossover of 7793 I can go to 7819 level successful crossover that can take me to 7835 so by this process if I can see this strategy has a maximum liability intacted till 6000 rupees if the nifty fallen fall to 7528 level and if it maintains to manage and plus that 7900 level I have a probability to gain 16,888 so and if I wish to say see what is the net Greeks now so net Greeks at current price of 7750 it is putting at 1.61 I can I can I can slightly reduce one lot and I need maximum I need maximum exposure of 10 percent so it is 10.8 percent it is coming so I can reduce one lot so that my liability and profit also will slightly get reduced but it is well balanced it will become that 10 per 10 percent net net delta 10 percent it will be it will be validated here so 10.88 percent and as I will move off my net delta is going to move up and I am going to gain the profit and once my net delta is falling down then my losses also will be there so at 6880 level when my losses will be at 1800 my net delta also will be fall down to 0.56 means from 10 percent to 5.86 percent I will be falling down so in that time you can think of again bringing into 10 percent also that is good if you want to balance that and if you do not if you do not want to add, do that adjustment you can keep that strategy as it is so this is how you form the delta neutral strategy i'll be just taking you to one more strategy which is consistent profit giving strategy so here what i did i did little bit modification in the covered call covered call strategy and along with one put i have added so on this strategy I have already given one article in our website how to earn 70% return per annum trading in nifty so this I am going to demonstrate month and month basis so here what we are going to do buying a future selling a call option but that call option will be 200 points above the nifty level and this call option for the next month series and I am going to buy a put option 
by factoring suppose future I have bought at x price I will be call option I have sold at y so I will take x minus y wherever I am landing so that nearest put option I will be buying I will show that trade also so I am just going to show its performance from the May, June and July so month of May on the April settlement 2nd May I am just taking nifty future is being bought at 6724 200 point above 6900 call option of June is being sold and 6500 put option by factoring this 200 points I am getting that 6500 level my nifty is coming so 6500 put option I am buying at 152 on 29th May the May series expiry future was 7235 6900 call option at 382 and 6500 put was 0 this call option for June month so it was 382 so profit and loss if I will just calculate so it is coming to 7235 minus 6724 again 217 minus 382 minus 152 it is coming to 9700 profit same strategy I am repeating in the month of June also 29th May May series has expired I have taken for the June June future is being bought at 7266 200 point above 7500 call July is being sold at 113 7150 which is nearest strike by lessing this 113 from the 7266 so it is being bought at 75 so 26th June its performance was 95 point gain it has given at a level of 7496 173 for 7500 call and 7150 put option at 0 so it has rewarded 4750 again same strategy I am taking for the on 26th June for the July I am buying the July future at 7534 and I am selling 7700 call option of August at 140 and 7400 put July I am buying at 99 so on 35 31st July at 7745 level if I can estimate this strategy is giving me 5370 rupees profit so all in all assuming 12 months in the year if 8 months you are getting success means nifty records a positive gain of 200 point or above and 4 months are failure with an average profit of 5000 you can gain 20,000 profit net profit out of this strategy means 8 months you can get 40,000 profit 4 months you will be losing 20,000 net and net you will be getting 20,000 profit with one investment of near about 35,000 this includes margin as well as your M2M requirements so considering this is a this is not being done with delta 0 considering no technical is being applied here except you are going to form this strategy blindly however if you can do some some bit little bit of technicals in this means if you are forming such a nifty cover call with put strategy along with say five five lots of nifty covered call with put you are forming and one or two lots of bank nifty covered put with call you are forming then maybe if there is a 50% success and 50% failure also you will be at a profit and if you oscillate for two to three times in a month suppose your strategy has given you some 5000 profit you booked it then market retrace back again you enter similar kind of strategy if you can oscillate for two to three times on the same strategy in a month then your profit will be amazingly high I am considering without any speculation without entering multiple trades in the same strategy taking in the first day of the settlement cycle closing it in the last day of the settlement cycle if eight months are successful so your money can yield you 60 to 70 percent return per annum so 
if you speculate little bit if you manage it with some other counters then your profit will be much more promising and it much more realistic so this with the help of our strategy software you may find it very easy to form this kind of strategy and you may minimize a lot of paper watts by looking into various uh, factors of delta, vega and theta.